the best advice that I always give to uh, young creators of any kind, but especially writers, is you have to do the work. You know, writers write, artists draw, filmmakers shoot film. Don't just sit around talking about it or thinking about what you're going to do. You have to do it. And it won't be very good. And that's okay, because you'll learn from it. And that's the other thing, is you must finish projects, because that's how you learn from them. You don't, don't get halfway through something and then abandon it and start something else, because you'll only get halfway through that and then abandon that and start something else. And, and you never learn that way. You can only learn and get better when you have finished a project and you're able to look at it and assess it as a whole thing. Because until it's finished, there's always a voice at the back of your mind that says, oh, I can fix it. Oh, all these problems, all these things that I can see are wrong with it. I can make them better in the last 20 pages or two minutes or whatever. And it's not true. It's never true. But if you think that, you won't be able to therefore critically look at those mistakes and think, how can I avoid them next time? So you must finish your projects, even if it's a 500 word short story, even if it's a one page comic or a two minute indie film, it doesn't matter. Make something, finish it, learn from it and make the next thing better. That's, that's life. That's work. That's what being a creator is. That's all there is to it. There is no secret, just hard work, perseverance, and trying to get better with every project. I'm a great believer that writer's block is simply fear. Writer's block is what happens when writers are afraid that what we write will not be as good as the perfect shining thing that we have imagined in our heads. Uh, and once you learn to get past that and realize that, no, it won't, and it never will be, and that's okay, then writer's block is no longer really an issue. So it's a kind of a combination of the two things. I am quite disciplined. You know, I, I write every day, I get up, I have a routine, I hit my word count, um, and I feel good about it. And I'm, you know, I'm very disciplined in that sense. On the other hand, you say, how do you, you know, find the, the time and the, the passion to sort of do all these different things? My question to other creators is, how do you have the restraint not to want to do all of these things? We are here on this earth for such a short time. Why would you not want to do everything? Why would you not want to create as many things as you can, tell as many stories as you can, do as many things as you can in as wide a variety as possible? Because, you know, tomorrow I could get run over by a bus and it's all, and that's the end of it. So yeah, got to do these things.